Hello everyone, this is Report of the Week here. Good afternoon, good evening, whatever time it is in your area, good to that. You can see the general area I'm in, you can, I'm sure recognize it from previous videos I've done. Uh, absolutely certain you can. You know, it's a dark board in the basement here. Right now, we're not doing a Failing with Darts video. You see, ladies and gentlemen, I'm doing a more important video, and I suggest you watch uh, as much of it as you could possibly withstand. This is an announcement. I guess we'll just be saying, I have a few words to say. We'll also just talk about things to come with this channel, and things that might not. Ladies and gentlemen, recently, uh, I'm not going to lie to you here, my channel has been going through pretty turbulent times. It's that simple. You know, back in February, uh, following the, you know, the anniversary, three-year anniversary blowout, I decided to take a break. And I feel that was a... It was a decent decision, in my opinion, uh, for me. I came back about a month later, began doing these VORW shows. At first, the VORW shows did exceptionally well. And I know, I said this yesterday, I mean not to say this in a narcissistic manner, uh, but I think they did very well. I think the shows performed well. Uh, you see how I read the fan mail and what have you, and uh, you know it was a generally positive reception. And that's always good to see. Lately, however, things have been going south. And when I say this, uh, once again, know that I'm not saying it in a narcissistic manner. But, lately, the view counts have been dropping. People have been unsubscribing in disgust. Uh, people have been really, you know, sharing their mind, uh, talking their mind with me. Speaking their mind. And not in a positive manner. What am I getting to you here? I screwed up, and now I'm facing the repercussions. How, though, people might be wondering. I like your shows, I like your content. How could things possibly go wrong? Well, I'll tell you how they did. I came back from my break, and I started doing the VORW shows. And it was a side of my channel which many people have never seen before. You know, these 45 minute long audio only lectures. And it covered random topics, what have you, uh, as I would hope uh, in a more refined manner than I would in my reviews, per se. You know, I tried to keep the show more professional and for the most part, people enjoyed it. But let's face it, my channel came to be for its energy drink and food reviews. And that's why a lot of people stayed with me. They wanted to see these reviews. They wanted to see what item I was going to review next. And now here I am, sitting here doing these lectures and dedicating to my, my time to all those. Uh, who wants to see someone do that? You know, a varying amount of people. Some do, some don't. I appreciate that. There is no problem there. The problem emerged about a week ago, and uh, things have gone downhill, and they're going downhill fast. That's why I'm actually sitting here right now talking to you uh, in front of a video camera instead of a microphone. I started a series uh, last week, or early this week, 
on shortwave radio. I made multiple episodes talking about both the premise, function, and various other components of shortwave radio. It has been met with extremely negative uh, reception by more people than I would have thought. You know, I always say, well, people, uh, there's always, uh, you know, people PMing me with trash and what have you. And this goes beyond that. So I know people that might have enjoyed my previous shows and videos and what have you clearly don't like this. And once again, that's fair. I don't have a problem with that. You know, I give people freedom. I figure, well, if you don't want to watch it, you don't have to. I'll upload it for the people that do. There's no problem with that. Here's where the problem came in. In a recent episode of my lecture with the shortwave radio, I said, I acknowledged this before, I said, the view counts are down. Why is that? I said, why is that? And I said, it's because, it's because, I believe I said, people aren't eager to learn about something new. That's what I said. If I could go back in time right now, I would have just cut off the microphone right when I said that, and I would have deleted that. But unfortunately, I'm too stupid you know, to really think about what I was going to say. And because of my foolishness and my anger, I stand in front of you today to apologize. I apologize to every last one of you for my stupidity, for my foolishness, for my anger, for my actions. The things I said in some of those videos were totally unacceptable. In a formal environment, such as the one I try to maintain, personal ideologies and blatant anger are unacceptable. What I did, I used my anger to blame innocent viewers for my own stupidity. I should have known from the get-go, ladies and gentlemen, I should have known from the very beginning, not as many people would be interested in shortwave radio. It's that simple. You know, there's plenty of people eager to learn, yes, but there's people who aren't. And I should have acknowledged that in the beginning. And unfortunately, my anger and my stupidity got in the way. And unfortunately, I took it out on all of you. Ladies and gentlemen, I sincerely apologize to every last one of you. I know I've driven away because of my remarks. I've driven away many, many long-time viewers. But if you're out there right now and you see this video and you're listening to it, please understand. I'm sorry. I messed up. It's my mistake. I screwed up. Last night, the guilt I was facing when I was reading in my inbox, people who were so upset and disappointed with me over my remarks in the shortwave lectures it was so extreme I just had to go to my security system, block the inbox, and I just could, I, I couldn't I couldn't visit that site anymore. I couldn't visit YouTube for a good few hours. I said I can't do this anymore. So I went out, took a walk, and I had to clear my mind. And with that being said, I began to think. And I knew I had to apologize for my stupidity and my actions, and my uncontrollable anger. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm sorry. What will come of this channel now, I do not know. 
I've destroyed my fan base. I've destroyed my reputation. I messed up. I screwed up. So what will this channel hold in the future? I really don't know. I don't know. I'm gonna have to take this day by day and see what happens. As much as I'd like to continue doing food reviews and energy drink reviews, I really don't know if I'll be able to live with myself while I'm sitting here trying to go back at this. I'm just gonna have to take it day by day and see how things are going. And we'll just uh, take it from there. For future videos, I'm definitely going to try to be in a happier mood uh, when I do start making reviews actively again. I really will try. You know, right now I'm just, I've been in a somber mood for the past four or five months at this point. But, uh, we'll see what, we'll see what we can do. But I've mostly made this video to apologize for my inconsiderate actions uh, on some of my lectures. That being said, I don't know when I will make a new lecture. I have to start rethinking this. I really don't know. But ladies and gentlemen, I hope you can forgive me for my actions. I really do. What will the future hold? I wish I could tell you.